Hi, Dr. Paul Hader, Master Herbalist, Spiritual Teacher here. Well, what do you think these are? Little purple capsules. They are don't have any smell to them at all. Let's see, what do they taste like? Um, very pungent. <laughs> Puckery to your mouth. That's all we're doing. Now, what can I talk here? <laughs> It's a amazing black currant. And uh, Dr. Derek Stewart of the Scottish Crop Research Institute thinks they are the number one super fruit. Super fruit. Number one super fruit. And known by the name of Ribes nigerum. And it gro gro grows around the world in colder climates. And it's a uh, part of the gooseberry family. And they have come in red and white and pink, and they, the darker the color, the better the antioxidants. And uh, it grows in California, in the northern parts, in New Oregon, and Washington, and Canada, on the east coast, in the northern uh, states, and up into Canada, and uh, really in Connecticut also. Also, uh, it's very popular in. In Siberia and also in Europe, in the colder climates there too. It uh, needs a little stevia honey if you're going to take the real berries because it's uh, really puckery, but really great. Full of lots of anthocyanins in it, and uh, these pigments are rich in antioxidants, and they do a great job. This, these berries contain up to 15 different antioxidants in them. And also help with heart disease and cancer and obesity and diabetes. It's a powerful anti-inflammatory. Helps with arthritis and redness and swelling and pain and joint pain. Great for the eyes because it has a lot of beta carotene and deanthine and uh, cryptoxanthine in it, which helps to prevent macular degeneration. Uh, has a good amount of iron, about 20%. A cup of it will have about 20% of your needs of iron, which help to prevent anemia, and so you're not dragging all the time. It uh, has a lot of free radical destroying capabilities that uh, get rid of DNA damage and uh, prevent DNA damage, which starts disease in general. It's good for cancer. There's a huge amount of studies showing it helps with cancer. Uh, Northeast uh, Ohio University College has showed that it inhibited liver cancer cells. So also that's great. Uh, in Japan, they found it helped with breast and endometrial cancer cells. Also, another one, the Journal of Medicinal Food found it helped with the stomach and esophageal cancer. So wow, pretty amazing stuff. It also has a super low glycemic index. I mean, it's low. And so it breaks down into sugars really slow, but it doesn't seem like it has any sugars at all. It's so puckery. <laughs> but it does. There's no doubt about it. <laughs> so it's great for your type 2 diabetics. It's great for your hair and nails. I just want hair, that's all. <laughs> Maybe I'll get it in my Christmas stocking. <laughs> Also, it helps with your skin and, and your nails also. It's great for the eyes. It has a lot of antioxidants that help to uh, prevent cataracts. And uh, that, this is actually connected to cataracts. The more antioxidants you have, <coughs> excuse me, the less possibility of coming down with the cataracts. Also helps to prevent Alzheimer's and Parkinson's and dementia. And it shows it helps to prevent diseases of the brain in general. And with many studies also. Helps with the ED or erectile dysfunction. And that's pretty amazing also. The best thing is to go on my diet at paulhater.com. And up in the right-hand corner, go on my diet. We can get rid of your DD, ED right away. Uh, a lot of studies showing that antioxidants reduce the, the possibility of coming down with ED or erectile dysfunction. Helps the heart, lots of antioxidants slow down the uh, atherosclerosis and the buildup of plaques in the heart arteries. It, uh, it's a brain booster. Yeah, it's a study show in a double blind study uh, with 36 participants, 18 to 35 years. It actually, they had better ability, cognitive abilities. They are more alert and more vigilant. So very, very good. Helps to prevent uh, urinary tract infections. 
and laboratory studies that actually work just as well as some of the cranberries and some of the other berries at actually uh, stopping bacteria from adhering to the bladder wall. And so that actually stops, you know, the infection. Also, a powerful antioxidant defense for the whole body in general. And it helps with anemia, with iron, as I said before. And that helps with f helping with fatigue and mu muscle weakness. It helps, to, helps you to sleep better, too, you know. It has a lot of magnesium in it, which helps you to feel more relaxed and feel more soothed and calm down and get rid of anxiety. And so you sleep better and, st and stop the possibility of having insomnia, which is really cool. <laughs> has an anti antioxidant rating of 7,000, almost 8,000 uh, units, ORAC -R units, so that's powerful. And it improves your digestion. Oh, a lot of people don't think about fiber as being important. Oh, I gotta take a fiber. You know, it is important because probiotics live in that environment of lots of fiber, and then they change your mood, they boost up your immune system, they change your body in general, get rid of the inflammation, everything. There's no nothing it doesn't touch. So fiber is super, super, super important. Uh, these little berries and capsules are the real thing. You also help to prevent kidney stones. They actually change the pH of the urine and excrete more citric acid and uh, oxalic acid out of the body so that you don't come down with kidney stones. It boosts up your immune system because it has a lot of vitamin C in it. And studies show that vitamin C can slow down the uh, occurrence of, you know, colds and flus and respiratory problems, even uh, pneumonia and diarrheal infections also. And studies in Finland showed that in 12 studies, they actually cut the common cold incidence by 91%. 91%, wow. And slashed the incidence of pneumonia from 80 to 100 percent, you know, we'll get your vitamin C and these black current, you know, berries or capsules. Protects against bacterial and virus infections. Uh, also, in 2012 study in Japan, uh, in the Journal of Microbiology and Immunity, uh, showed that just a 1 percent solution of black current actually uh, slowed down the growth of certain strains of viruses of, uh, and bacteria. So, Wow. And another one showed that a 10% concentration actually blocked 95% of the viruses from sticking to surface of the cells. And that's what they need to do in order to proliferate. So amazing, really. Another study in the uh, Ashikawa Medical College in Japan showed that actual uh, treating strains of the influenza uh, with black current uh, the actual growth stopped in general. It, the virus wasn't able to replicate. <clears throat> this wonderful berry also helps with gastric ulcers. So it found that the blackcurrant oil helped to guard against H. pylori and other types of stomach ulcer bacteria and uh, helps with the abdominal pain and nausea too. Also slows the occurrence of herpes outbreaks. A uh, study published in Phytotherapy showed that the extracts of, of black currants actually stopped the uh, herpes virus from actually sticking to cells and stopped the spread of the virus in, in general. And used in combination with L-lysine and with zinc, it did a really great job. So that's something to think about there. It contains a lot of different agents in it, a lot of different minerals like copper and iron, like I said, for anemia, calcium, which is good for strong bones, phosphorus for strong bones, manganese and magnesium for good sleep and enzyme production, potassium for heart contraction and for uh, water regulation, and essential also for metabolism in general. Uh, the dose is about 200 milligram daily or more. It's food, so eat, you know, just about whatever you like as far as that goes. But it's not for those who are pregnant, nursing, or small children. And once in a great while, it's very rare that somebody has an allergic reaction to it. Uh, large doses, just like anything, will give you gas and headaches and diarrhea. 
<laughs> just about anything will do that. It's not for those who are on uh, anti-clotting medications, you know, uh, it may interfere with that. <clears throat> you can also cook it, and uh, you can find, make it into jams and jellies and uh, baked goods and all kinds of savory dishes also. You can look up a plethora of all kinds of black currant uh, recipes out there are really good for you. Also, you can find it on Amazon and eBay and uh, lots of different places uh, out there. You can just Google find buy black currants. During the, you know the, the the season when the fresh berries out, you can actually even get uh, fresh berries too, which is really wonderful. I have to say, you know, I've gone up into uh, Oregon and Washington and Canada and picked the fresh uh, berries. They are really puckery, but they make a a really great uh, uh, additive to a breakfast or anything else, adding a little stevia to it, a little bit of honey, and uh, really a wonderful treat if you have them fresh. Uh, I highly recommend them. So also, I highly recommend that you go to my website at paulhader.com, that's www.paulhaider.com, and go up in the right-hand corner, right beside testimonials, and click on My Diet, and uh, we can help to get rid of all kinds of diseases. We've had uh, lots of different things, from MS to um, just about you know, rheumatoid arthritis to just about anything. I can't, I'm really amazed that My Diet does this. It's anti-inflammatory. It helps to get rid of all kinds of disease processes. I have to say that about... 90% of what we have going on in the world, as far as diseases go, is connected directly to diet. In fact, a new study came out today showing exactly that, that um, most of our diseases now are directly related to diet, diet, diet. And so if you go on my diet, we can get you in the pink in no time. What's, uh, in a, you know, you can be running around like me at 66, doing 100 pull-ups, 100 push-ups, 100 crunches, and walking eight miles a day and feeling great <clears throat> all the time. And as far as taking supplements go, you know, I recommend that you take a lot of different foods. There's, you know, about, uh, people eat about six foods in general, you know, six foods. <laughs> That's really about it. And I had some people say, just tell me what to eat every day. And I was like, no, you've got to have a lot of different foods in your diet. You got to do, you know, every different food has a lot of different antioxidants and a lot of different minerals and, and different uh, agents, uh, flavonoids and different things. And they all work together in a consort that helps to make you have great health. And so I think it's really important that we eat a lot of different foods as much as possible and allow yourself to eat organic, organic, organic. I have to say that over and over again. You know, the average potato has 32 chemicals in it. Not good. And the average parsley has over 40 chemicals in it. Not good. Uh, we really need to uh, support our organic farmers and we get a, a box of organic food every Thursday and it's uh, $50 and it's more than my wife and I can eat and plus we get whatever we get out of the garden also and so in the long run if you actually save money and uh, you'll be in great shape and uh, feel healthy and uh, really take advantage of the long life that you could really are supposed to have and I highly recommend that. If you want to get a hold of me feel free to my phone number is 831-869-9119. 831-869-9119. And my email is drpaulhader at gmail.com. That's D-R-P-A-U-L-H-A-I-D-E-R at gmail.com. And everything is listed down below. Hit show more and it's down there. <laughs> <laughs> My consults are always no charge, uh, but I really appreciate a, a donation. Really, I uh, thank you for that. Uh, we do a lot of research, and we are trying to help everybody as much as possible, but we do have expenses, and uh, we got to eat, too. <laughs> 
So we appreciate your help in every way, shape, and form. Please also watch the little ads on here with AdSense, and uh, they bring a couple pennies. Really, not a lot, really, but a little bit in our direction. And also, feel free to contact me whenever you can. My, you can text me, WhatsApp me, that type of thing. Please don't call me in the middle of the night. I mean, uh, I will not get up to answer uh, because, you know, I need my sleep too. <laughs> I have a lot of people from other countries, you know, they don't know what time zone it is, and they call me in the middle of the night. Uh, I don't get up and answer it, please. I'll get back to you. Please, if you live outside the U.S. or Eastern Standard Time, please uh, email me, and that's the best way, and I'll get back right back to you the next day. And if you don't get an email back within, you know, 24 hours, you know, uh, email me again. Well, uh, sometimes I get up to 400 emails a day, so it's, it's quite a bit. And I will get back to you, and I promise that for sure. So allow yourself to subscribe. I hope you will. And tell other people we're trying to get to 100,000 subscribers this year. And tell others and spread the word. And But the most important thing of all is to remember, I love you.